atmosphere essential for life air and water atmosphere is the mass of air surrounding the earth the atmosphere helps to maintain the earth's temperature it surrounds us wherever we go and is necessary for our survival without the atmosphere there could be no life on earth it is held near the surface of the planet by earth's gravitational force essentially the atmosphere is a collection of gases that makes the earth habitable it consists of 78 nitrogen 21% oxygen 1% water vapor and a minute amount of other gases like argon and carbon monoxide let us begin with oxygen oxygen is a life supporting component of air we need oxygen to breathe and if breathing is stopped there is no supply of oxygen to the brain and the cells begin to die nitrogen is a naturally occurring element that is essential for growth and reproduction in both plants and animals all the living things require nitrogen for their growth plants take nitrogen from the food they eat carbon dioxide carbon dioxide is a gas which is vital to life on earth green plants use carbon dioxide gas to make their food it is even used commercially in fire extinguishers and to carbonate beverages properties of air like all matter air has weight except space the weight of air varies with pressure and temperature the pressure exerted by air is called atmospheric pressure and it is measured with an instrument called barometer water is very important for life we need water to drink to wash hands to cook to water plants and many other things we get water from rivers ponds lakes and rain water is also present under the ground which can be useful with the help of wells hand pumps etc there are various methods through which we can remove insoluble impurities from water one such method is sedimentation in which the impure water is allowed to stand in a container leaving the impurities at the bottom which is known as sediment when impurities settle down clear water is left above this process is called sedimentation when the clean water after sedimentation is poured in a container without disturbing the impurities it is called decantation filtration it is a process by which the insoluble impurities like sand is filtered using a filter paper like we remove insoluble impurities from water we can also remove soluble impurities by evaporation and distillation process when the solution containing soluble impurities is heated water changes to steam and the impurities are left behind this process is called evaporation in distillation process the impure water is heated in a flash on heating water changes into steam and impurities are left behind in the flash the steam passes through the condenser where it is cooled and turns into pure water which is collected in a separate flash we can purify the water by boiling for some minutes in order to kill the germs present in it tablets containing chlorine can also be added to the water for killing germs 
One more method is the usage of electric water purifiers for the purification of water.